Lake Sidewinders. Are your week six champions here at Cooperstown Dreams Park? The Salt Lake Sidewinders 12 and under Little League team did something special on July 11th. They traveled to Cooperstown, New York, home of the Baseball Hall of Fame, to play in the Cooperstown Dreams Park Tournament, one of the most prestigious Little League tournaments in the country. Swing and a miss, strike three. In the end, they were the last out of 104 teams still standing. The first team from Utah to bring home a championship trophy from Cooperstown. It was the sweetest thing that's ever happened to me. It was, it was awesome to win it all. When the ball started going, it went up in the air and I just saw it and I just know, I knew that it was out and I would remember that my whole life. The feeling at the end was unbelievable. You could feel all those years coming together and you're so proud of these guys right here, you know, because they had to do so much. All those practices, all of it, you feel this culmination of all those things. And I look back and I see those boys holding that trophy over their head. Can't even explain how cool it felt. Their accomplishment is newsworthy, but how they did it is extraordinary. Ethan Falk's parents learned when he was two years old that he had autism. Well, your first thought is uh, is obviously about life and what uh, you know what he may deal with throughout his lifetime. But uh, that lasts a very short period of time, and then you realize what capabilities that he does have. One thing Ethan can do is play baseball. Playing the sport he loves and being part of the Sidewinders has made a huge difference in his life. You know, some autistic kids can't uh, control their emotions. Like there are kids like me that can't help but to just go on the ground pretend, pretending that they can't do it, but they can do anything. So now the potential winning run steps in. Ethan Falks out in right field now. He's 0 for 2. He showed what he can do in the Cooperstown Championship. His team down 2 nothing in the final inning, two teammates on base, and one out. What I remember about Ethan's at bat was confidence when he went out. He knew that when he, you know, when he stepped to the plate, he had a shot. Home run here would send the Salt Lake fans into pandemonium. 1-1 one, one pitch. Swing and a fly ball, deep right field. And that one is out of yeah. here. Three run home run wins the ball game. All of us just started screaming and ran out on the field. Well, when I touched the plate when I was coming home, my teammates just charged at me, you know, like doing the dog pile. And this is an absolute dream come true. And, uh, you know, the celebration at home, you know, when, uh, when we won the championship game, that, uh, you know, I, there was not a dry eye, you know, <laughs> at least in my family, you know, as we, uh, as we celebrated together. Probably one of the most wonderful experiences of my life, you know, like making history in Cooperstown. Hit a walk off to win Cooperstown and getting a trophy that's the size of this big and having to make history to make Utah proud.